Your kicks. Welcome back to your kicks. Welcome back to your kicks. Year, what's going on, y'all? It's your boy Black Trey from Your Kicks, your network, bringing you another one. So, I just want to welcome you to episode 18 of the weekly sneaker preview. This is the preview for all the Jordans dropping in March. Check me out. So, first off, we're starting off with the Jordan Delta Breathe. These are our releasing on the third, 130 on these. Like what they're doing right here with these. Uh, consideration for the pickup. I'm um, not too big of a fan on the pinks, but I got a couple of hoodies, a couple of shirts that definitely match this. Definitely, I, I do like it, though. Next up, we have the Air Jordan 4 Golf White Cement. You know, they also have some 4s, the white cements that aren't in golf. You know, th those I'm looking forward to. I'm not a golfer, but these are coming out on the 4th, retailing for 220 Kind of like this shoe, though. I, I like the, I'm trying to get my hands on the white cement, the regular joints. So we'll see what it is on those. Next up, we have the Jordan Delta Mid. Like what they're doing on these. These are the Hosta colorway. Not bad. Not bad at all, actually. Um, the Delta Mids, I've been liking them more as they've been coming out. And I've been seeing them more. They, they're introducing a lot of colors i do like the green on these this is definitely something my speed next up we have the jordan ma future beginnings uh, these are retailing for 150 in men's and women's i like the deal i like what they're doing right here with these this is actually a pretty dope pickup not bad not bad not bad at all you feel what i'm saying all right next up we have the air jordan one retro high og university blue you know they're paying homage to jordan and the UN unc you know that whole deal him representing for his alma mater and all that so you know that's pretty dope i like what they doing with this i like the the blue uh i like how they doing with the black i think it would look a little bit better if they may have you know not used as much black but you know it is what it is because you can definitely switch up to laces and get a different type of feel so it is what it is but definitely something i'm looking forward to on these these are retailing for 170 uh next up we have actually we have them in preschool those are retailing for 80 and we have them in infinite toddler those are retailing for 60. uh next up we have the grade schools on the same one damn <laughs> this is a whole family size on these 130 on these uh next up these are probably my favorite sleeper hit of march these are probably the ones that i probably want the most so we have the air Jordan one retro high og right here uh pantina pa pa patina love the colors on this like i'm normally not a big fan of the browns but i love how the brown sits on this shoe and just the designs and everything i think it complements itself very well on this love what they're doing with this um these are retailing for 170. definitely gonna be trying to get my hands on these it is what it is next up we have the jordan ma2 i like the colors on this right here so let's see what we got going on all right, so we got some grays, vast gray, uh, gym red, mahogany, and sap. These are retailing for 150. Like what they're doing with these, that made too, as you already know what it is. Got all these different colorways. This is definitely a hot, hot thing. Now we have the Jordan MA2, Woman in Power. Like what they done with these. Um, these are retailing. Oh, actually, we don't have the retail price on these as of yet. They are coming out on the 11th. We may have some more details, you know, as time goes by. Uh, well, if we do, we'll put some in, uh, some information on the channel. Uh, next up, we have the Air Jordan 9, Change the World 9s. I, I do like 9s. Definitely lower on my, you know, ranking of Jordans. Not really a big fan of the 9s, but these seem like they're pretty decent. Um, what do we got? These are coming out on the 13th. Retailing for 190 Women's release, you know. I like what they're doing right here. Let's see what we're talking about. All right. Jordan Brand prepares for their first woman exclusive Air Jordan 9 for 2021. Okay, so it's an exclusive for women. But I do like what they're doing with these. They got the yellow. The, why when Nike does something, they run it into the ground? Because it looks like these, like, they have all these shoes that's just, like, mismatch on the colors. I hear you. You feel what I'm saying? And there's only so many ideas that you can do when you, you know what I mean, you bring in new shoes to the table and everything like that. But, you know, at the end of the day, like, you know, y'all run certain ideas into the ground. But, you know, you guys put out so many shoes that, you know, it is what it is. 
Um, next up, we have the Jordan MA2. Uh, I don't even know if these have a... Um, okay, what is Ultramarine. There we go. So we got the Ultramarine jump walls. Like this right here. Like what they're doing with this. Uh, new to Jumpman family, the Jordan MA2 has already ready a large number of introductory colorways. We already knew that soon. We'll be seeing a lot more of the initial future beginnings, including the bread, impressions, uh, suede vast gray, and this newly unveiled Ultramarine homage. It bears no passing resemblance to the originals. The silhouette takes a few liberties with the ultramarine schemes swayed over the toe and heel color gray to better contrast its white nylon drop elsewhere pink dress this side and seldom these right here decent March 18th on these 150 on a release date all right next up let's see what we got let's see what we got next all right so next up we have the Air Jordan 3 Georgetown now if these are real heavy on the you know anticipation a lot of people are, are loving this right here the georgetown university relationship with jordan brand shines once again with the upcoming jordan 3 retro you know what i mean albeit on the unofficial level the dc based athletic program has seen itself appear on a number of air jordan retro player exclusives not unlike this uh, uh, not unlike this upcoming midnight navy cement gray pair only this retail version will, won't feature any of the school's official signi signia, insignia. So, it's an unofficial Georgetown, you know, collabo. I do like these. I like what they're doing with this. Uh, we have them coming out on the 20th. Men's will be 190. We have grade schools on the 140. We have preschools on the 80. And we have infinite toddler for 60, it's looking like. All right. Next up, let's see what we got coming up. All right, next up we have the Air Jordan 12. Um, wow, so this is an exclusive little girls release. They have them in grade school for 140, preschool for 90, and we have them in infant and toddler for 60. These are coming out on the 22nd. Let's see what we got on these. Uh, okay, so let's see. For 2021, Jordan Brand seems to be diverting quite a bit of manpower to the Air Jordan 12, alongside some Super Bowl ready releases. So you remember the Super Bowls that they came out with. Those are pretty okay. okay. And a new Easter colorway. Nice. The silhouette will be dressing up the hyper pink um, exclusively for girls. And this is no ordinary release. As the offering also experiments with some new materials. While the mud guard up front makes do with the smooth white leather and quilted fixtures behind are distressed quite heavy. It almost seems like these panels were originally white and are braided to the point of revealing the pink layers underneath. Elsewhere to build further cohesion, the eyelets, branded embroideries, linings, and heels, poles, uh, color to the very same floral shade. This is not bad right here. For the girls, you know what I mean? May put the girls in something like this. Something light, not too bad, not too expensive, you know. For the little kids, it's not too much, not too OD. Uh, not too, too bad, you know what I mean? But, yeah, you know, I like what they're doing over here with these. All right, next up, we got, I think this is the last one. So, but this is uh, basically family fun size. So we got the Air Jordan 5s. Now, these right here, these are the Stealth. All right, so let's go through the specs. So we have them in men's for 190 we have them in grade school for 140. We have them in preschool for 80. And we have them in infant and toddler for 60. These are coming out on the 27th of March. These are the last Jordan release for March. I like what they're doing with these. You already know what the fives. The fives are pretty cool. Um, let's see what we got here. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Yeah, you know. I like the colorway. I like what they're doing. You know what I mean? I think, uh, you know, for the, for the, I would say overall for the month, there's only like one set that I would say is like a must cop. Well, actually, no, the twos, because I do like the UNCs and I do like, um, I like the UNCs and I like brown joints, the high OGs, the pet patinas. Uh, yeah. So that's pretty much it for this week. You know, we're probably gonna drop a probably gonna drop another video in a couple of days. You know, just doing our regular thing for the rest of the sneakers that are coming out for the rest of the week and all that. But we're just knocking this out the way. 
You feel what I'm saying? It's your boy Black Trey from Your Kicks Your Network. Holla at me, cause we are here to stay. In some of his videos, he only shows his face, and in some, and in some, and in some of his videos, he only shows his shoes.